happening. This is really happening. It's going, to, it's going to be like three minutes long. I handled the costumes and the ditty bags. And Which ditty by bag. far was the easiest job because you weren't able to really handle anything else. So it was good right. for you. Well, I'm petite and it's hard for me to uh, right. lift heavy things. And you're not the brightest bulb. So it's good that you had a very simple job. I'm about to get hosed down and take a shower outside with the hose because our septic tank is full. I hope that the people that work with me learn to trust in themselves, learn to be brave, and more, most importantly, learn to join the adventure. Learn to embrace what life puts in front of you and say, oh, this is the challenge, this is the episode today. Great, let's, let's go for it. And he hasn't showered in four days. I'm four days, that. Allie! Hey, it's only been three days. Okay. And when you're outdoors, it's, it's a thing of the earth. It's not a man-made thing so much. So um, you have to just kind of do it in a really grounded way, and whatever goes wrong, goes wrong. You know, I do the laundry for the show, which I volunteered to do, which I'm happy to do, and, um, and I go through my show. It's great. I mean, this is... This is like why you do theater, and then and then I get to play Macbeth every time. Right. Oh, oh, you guys saved our seats. I want. I kept them warm for you. Thank you. Yeah. How's oh, everyone doing? All the groceries. Good. Good. Last day. I'm sure we all will. I'm sure <laughs> tonight we're gonna be like. <laughs> this is the part where you cut to us being crazy tonight. If the art. It makes you confront the things that you take for granted as an artist, and it makes you, I think the impact of seeing, you know, people who don't have access to this kind of art in their little small towns of 90 people. 90 people show up, and, and they watch your show, and whether it's five people that show up, those five people are so grateful for the experience of getting to see this show and having it brought to them and seeing it in this unique way. It, it's so worthwhile. I did brilliant work. As you can see, I've been rewarded for it. <laughs> yes, and I, I mean, to me, I just have to say, to be here with you on camera is like a dream come true, I guess. I actually meant to ask why she was in the interview. I was sort of under the assumption that these would be separate interviews. <laughs> yeah. Well, mayhaps next time I will be on my own. I'll talk to Stephen about that. Yes, perhaps.